I've been sleeping on the Stingray. It's cool, man. Yeah. It's really cool. Why should somebody even consider this over that? Okay, Leo was trying to do improvements, right? So he was trying to make a better fender. An improvement? <laughs> so is it even possible? <laughs> the big, big improvement in his mind was to make a giant humbucker, move it back by the bridge, and then he put a battery in the back making this actually the first mass-produced active bass. Absolutely, yeah. And it made this amazing range of sound. Even if we just hear the treble control, if I turn that off, okay, it sounds kind of, sort of like a vintage bass, but when you turn this treble control up, right, yeah, you hear yeah. all that, like, that sizzle. It was the beginning of the modern active bass sound.